It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. Game over. <laughs> it is Saturday and usually Kelvin and I don't get to fly on a Saturday because we got to work. But it is school time break right now and we've got permission from our higher HQ. So we're up here, out here, flying. We wanted to go to the F1 arena, which is just right over there. Uh, but I took off in less than a minute. It took less than a minute before the Rangers um, arrived and stopped us from flying. So we have no choice but to relocate ourselves into this, which turns out to be a better sport. It has like a tree area over there, tall trees. We have bridges and we have under tunnels. Yes, under tunnels. We have again more bridges and there's this huge ass power loop section area which I guess is less than 60 meters but it's still very tall. Mm -hmm. So yep, that's all that. Alright, enough of the talking. Let's watch some videos. Places his quad landed right in the middle of this screen of all places. And the damage of the day, all right, let's start off with this one. The capacitor broke off, and then it just starts losing control. The Vista just switched off, and then of all places, it went, it went into the water. So, very cool, very clean right now. And then my Titan XL5 
I broke the bottom plate. You see, woo -hoo. And well, other than that, everything else is intact. Um, with a bent prop. Everything else is intact, very cool. Truly my favorite basher port. Still gonna repair it and then bash it more. And then I have my black noise. This is fine because uh, I originally came up with this thing problem. I kind of solved it with the UAV text video guide. But 